gonna be doing a series of videos on how to maintain your laser. So I've brought in our resident expert, Adam Barasa. Hey guys. He does all the maintenance, QC, repairs and stuff for us, and he's kind of the expert. So instead of me trying to tell you how to do this stuff, I thought I'd bring the real guy in. So anything else about cleaning you wanna let us know before we uh, send off for this one? Yes, another uh, important one for home gamers is definitely the fans. I had a perfect example today that I blew out a customer's laser and there was dust all over the floor and <laughs> ended up having to sweep all that up. So it's just compressed air like you get at the hardware store? How's the best way to do that? If you can, get something in there, even something like these long Q-tips, get oh, in there and break off. some of that up. Yeah. A lot of people use canned air. I don't exactly like it, but canned air is better than nothing. Mm -hmm. Air compressors are great, but one thing you have to watch out for is your fans in here. If you hear that zzz from your fan over speeding, you're, you're doing it wrong. So kind of hold them in place and blow them. Then. Yes, absolutely. That's another thing we've done in the past too, is stick a zip tie or a Q-tip inside the fan to keep it from rotating mm -hmm. while you're blowing while the you're dust blowing. out. All right, cool. Well, great. Hopefully people can see this and they can learn how to do some basic maintenance on their laser to make sure it looks the best for their shows and also keeps it out of his hands and he can worry about the big stuff when people throw a laser off a truck.